Hello! In this video I will install and print with LBP722 printer and also focus on the counter, log and some special print features. The following will be demonstrated in this video and in the upper right corner of the screen you can find my full product review of this printer. Let me start with some basic info. This model is a fast color laser printer with two-sided printing and network features. You can find more videos on LBP printers in the playlist on my channel. The print counter you can find in the two ways. There is check counter menu available from the printer screen, where you find total, color and black and white value. But you can also log in with remote user interface and select printer status and check the counter. The counter can be remotely read using print management software, such as IWMC and you can find more under following link. I go to printer status again and select the job log. This is full history of the usage of the printer. And you can also find the history of the cartridge usage. It will tell you if non-original cartridges have been used in the printer. As well, you can print a report. In the next part, I will print using direct PDF print option, which is available from the remote user interface menu. I pick one of my test PDF files, select print settings and send the PDF to the printer. This way you can print without the driver installation. Let's print another file which is password protected. I get an error that my file cannot be printed. I select the same file again and this time I enter the file password.
After deleting the previous print job, the password protected PDF is printed. Let's see the log of the direct PDF print. There are more advanced print features available on this model, such as force hold print or encrypted secure print, and you can find more about this in the web manuals as I move on to the installation of the printer driver to the computer. Let's download the latest driver from the Canon Download Support site. Different types of drivers, such as PCL, Postscript and UFR driver are listed. I recommend to choose the Ultra Fast Rendering UFR Canon driver for this printer. Here I download the file and run the setup file. My printer has already been connected to the local Wi-Fi network and you find the setup of the printer in the upper right corner of the screen. The driver will take about a minute to install and I speed up a little bit. There is another video with more useful information to the user about this printer in the video in the upper right corner of the screen. After installation has been finished, restart the computer. Let's now walk through the main tab of the UFR driver which is using the PC power combined with the processing on the printer to speed up the print job. So this driver may be the fastest when printing big files. You can find different print settings already on the main tab, like N on 1. Here I printed 9 pages on one page. You can select one-sided, two-sided, or you can print a booklet. Let me show you now some additional special driver features. When printing a document, you can select output method as edit and print. Select the settings and print and before you print your document you can see the full preview how your file will be printed. For the next print I will put different paper to the manual tray. I will print only 3 pages from the 10 page PDF document, but I will use the mixed feed option. It is very practical way of printing seminars or projects where you can use the manual tray to feed heavier type of media, maybe for the first and last page of your document. 
first page will be taken from the paper cassette, second page from the manual feeder and last page again from the paper cassette. The first page has been printed. Here I confirm to feed the page from manual tray. And this is the result. And the last example, I will print a color PDF document using two colors only. I will select magenta and black color combination. And this also gives special effects to the printed document. And that would be all in this video. Find more about iSenses or Image Class printers in the playlist on my channel Feel free to comment, ask questions, like the video if you find it useful so I can grow my channel and make more videos about printers. Do not forget to subscribe, turn on the bell if you want to be notified about my future videos. Thank you for watching and sharing. Bye!